welcome to the Jake Games Stram. Yo, what's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of Fallout New Vegas. We are going to be picking up right where we left off. If you guys have missed out on any episodes, like always, check out the playlist. You can get yourself caught up on the ones that you've not yet seen. Let's uh, let's jump right into it. Let's see what we're going to be getting ourselves into here. Feels odd pulling off the uh, the cowboy accent. You know, we had the cowboy going on for so long but now we're uh we're no longer cowboy up you know so anyways we're gonna go talk to sunny smiles about fighting the powder gangers so we're trying to defend a feller and not let the powder gangers kill this feller so she tends to be hanging out in the bar that's pretty cool she's, she's a pretty cool person you know just hanging out in the bar all the time that's pretty dope and you what up, Easy Pete? Not gonna pull my weapon on you again like I did last time. That was, uh, you know, that was a mistake. We don't need to be pulling our weapon out on Easy Pete all the time. He's a nice feller. Whoa, whoa, whoa! We just got a new subscriber. Welcome. Uh, is that Bill? Bill Choi. Much appreciated. Thanks for subscribing. Very cool of you, and welcome. Glad to glad to have you. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer. I'm going to help Ringo out with the powder gangers. Say Might no need more. your help. I'm in. Nice. Sonny's in. Well, that was easy. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. Okay, However, okay. between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Mr. Awesome Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere. And Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. Uh, any idea how to convince Trudy to join us? A silver tongue would help. Convincing Trudy that we had a good plan to win the fight oh. would also help. Okay. Uh, would Chet be willing to give us his supplies? I mean, give is in Chet's vocabulary. Even with the town at stake... He'd hmm. still make you barter with him. Okay, how can I get Easy Pete's dynamite? Easy Pete's pretty protective of his dynamite. You'd have to convince him you know a thing or two about explosives before you handed it okay, over. Okay, this sounds like this is going to be a little bit of a, a tough uh, endeavor here. Um. Alright, well, goodbye. I'm going to go try and convince these people to help us out. And um, hopefully it works out. Where is Trudy? You're just a settler. Where is, where is she at? Don't tell her that I'm using the toilet here for free without buying anything. Delicious, delicious toilet water. I can't, I can't stop drinking the toilet water. Trudy, God dang it, Trudy. Where did you get off to? Fudge. All right, I'm gonna. Can I sit and wait? Let's see if we can wait a little bit. Uh, what time is it? It's 9 p.m. Okay, let's wait like. 12 hours, something like that. 13 hours, good enough. Let's try it. Let's see what happens. She going to show up at her bar in the morning, right? Trudy, you're back. Awesome, though. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. Oh, she heard That's already. Risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. Got to do what you got to do. Um... We're a little outnumbered against the powder gangers. Think you could help? All the more reason for me oh. to sit this one out. I'll be rooting for you, though. Dang it, dude. I don't have enough. So I need um, 25 speech to get her to convince. Want me to take a look at your broken radio? Sure. The outside looks okay, but I think something broke on the inside. There'd be caps in it for you. I do like to hear what's going on in the world. And that Mr. New Vegas seems like such a gentleman. All right, so, um, well, dang, dude. I, I can't convince her. Be careful her. out there. Oh, wait, I leveled up. Welcome to level two. So, I need 25 speech. I'm going to put a couple blops into, blops? Why did you call them blops? <laughs> what the heck is even a blop? Some points into into speech um 
what else did she say? Barter, right? If I pump up my barter, I might be able to get some goods from that one dude. Let's do speech and barter only. Explosives? Like, dude, there's no way. It, with the amount of points I have, I'm not going to hit uh, enough on explosives. So there's no point in that. We could do a lockpick. Let's try that out. Because that should... Um, confirmed bachelor. In combat, you do 10% against male opponents. Outside of combat, you'll sometimes have access to unique dialogue options when dealing with the same sex. Um, you can put a single point in any of your special attributes. Lady Killer. Swift Learner. With each rank in Swift Learner, you gain 10 additional experience points whenever... Okay, I'm doing that, dude. That sounds like that's going to help me get leveled up faster, right? Trudy, Trudy, Trudy. I know we just spoke, but... Take care of that. Let's try this again, because I'm a little bit more convincing now. I was planning on sitting this one out, but for some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. I'm pretty smooth. Let me have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. I think I might be able to convince him, too. But anyways, um, she might be digging the merch. I think maybe that's why she's like... Yeah, you know what? There's there's just something about the way this guy looks with that that hat and that shirt. Like, I don't know. I just kind of I think I need to help him. Be careful. I'll see you later, there. Trudy. Appreciate you. I'm gonna go get some of your fellow townsfolk to help me out. Also, one down. I know you're gonna be a butthole, aren't you? Howdy. Here you got dynamite. It would help us beat the powder gangers. Too dangerous. Gonna kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. Uh, yep. I had 11 out of 25. Never mind. Yep. So you can just kind of frig off. Freaking easy, Pete. Yep. How about you? Take it easy. What do you think of that? Jerk. Next up, let's see here. General store. Hey there, Chet. Howdy. You um, must be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Even got some weapon mods and special ammo. Well, well you reckon you got any supplies to, to loan us? If you're for caps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Can we actually buy ammo that doesn't work very well? I need supplies to fight the powder now gangers. just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. Hmm, barter. Oh yeah, dude, I got enough barter. You made your point. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. Nice. And uh, I'll Very be nice. guarding the store while all this is going on. I have to put my business first. You understand. Okay, so he's not going to actually fight with us, but he's giving us some stuff. Take it That's easy good. now. Uh, I think I can... Who else can I talk to? I think the dock, right? Isn't the dock over here somewhere? Is this Doc's house? I keep forgetting that I don't have, like, sprint. You're pretty much... You're just stuck on one speed. Yeah, Doc Mitchell. He's gonna help us out, I think. Mr. Doc Mitchell, would you like to help us out fighting the powder gangers? Doc. Doc. Hello, sir. Have a seat. You're gonna need Welcome to sit down back. for this one. I had hope you wouldn't need to come see me again so soon. Um, I need medical supplies. Sure. Oh wait, no, that's I did the wrong thing. Um, town's gonna be attacked by bandits. Anything you could do to help? Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never right. leave each that's other alone. Right. That's a fact. Alone. That's well, a fact. I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce, but I'll give you what I can spare. Um, they'll be using explosives. Do you have something more s for more serious injuries? I ain't got much, but it'll do you more. Oh, dude, I actually have enough medical to here. do that. Take what I got. All right, cool. Goodbye. You take care now. Nice, dude. I'm pretty convincing, actually. Three out of however many. That's not not too bad. Who else? Uh, we can go talk to Ringo, that butthole. In I think this is leading me to friggin' Easy Pete. He ain't gonna help us. 
Let's see about this radio. I did have like a radio quest, right? Is it miscellaneous? Um. I thought she wanted me to look at her radio. Is that not like an actual busted radio? There we go. Let's see about that. I might be able to fix that, right? Where's she keeping her radio? Is it in the bar? Are you... I think her radio might be in the bar. Where's your... Where's your radio? I hear music playing. You mean to tell me... That this is broken? Repair of 20 or greater. Do I... What kind of repair do I have? Leave it alone. Okay, so I can't fix it. My repair skill is not high enough yet. So... I think that's all we can do. Easy pizza butthole. He ain't gonna help us. I can't fix no freaking radio. God dang it, man. I ain't no radio technician. Should have known better. Need to get my repair up. But anyways, guys, uh, before we go into this massive fight, things are going to get bonkers. So make sure you hit that like button for getting into massive fights with these uh, dudes who throw dynamite. Uh, also, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future episodes of this. And turn on the notifications because you're not going to want to miss out on the streams also. You know, I stream this live on Twitch and YouTube. You can follow on Twitch. You can uh, join the Discord if you want to come by and chat. You can do all that cool stuff. So Ringo. what's going on? Did Sonny agree to help us? Sonny's with us. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. How can Unless we lose? Unless you think there's something else you can do. Um... Nope, I think we're good. All Let's right, do this. I'm ready. I hope. What else can I do? Time to look alive. The powder gangers are here to Oh, play. fudge. Uh, how many are there? At least six. Joe Cobb included. They so there's three me. three of us against six? Fudge it. Let's go. Wait, Trudy's out there. Is, is Trudy Let's gonna help? The gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Yeah, Trudy's gonna help us. So four against six. That's not too bad of odds. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Random citizens, maybe they'll help out a little bit, you know, just grab a gun, start shooting, that's all you gotta do. They can handle that, right? Hey, powder gangers, I'm gonna shoot you. Okay, maybe I should use vats a little bit. Oh, I shot him good. I shot him real good. Did I do it? Oh, I'm getting butt up. I'm getting a little bit butt up, but I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Just just stand your ground, you know. Just hang, chill, chill out here. Just hang out here. Is that Joe Cobb? God dang it, Joe Cobb. I've done it. <laughs> Easy peasy. Uh, establish a reputation with a group of people in the wasteland. Whether that reputation is good or bad... Finally, somebody and people associated with that group will start to react to what you've done. There are many different factions in the Wasteland. You can develop a distinct reputation with each one. As you perform actions that benefit a group, you will gain fame. If you perform actions that harm a group, you will gain infamy. The reputation with any given group is a measure of combined total fame and infamy that you have earned. The benefits and drawbacks of any given reputation depend on the group itself. You may receive discounts with merchants, provoke attacks from hired thugs, or simply be treated differently. Hmm. Yo, that's actually pretty interesting. Oh, though you'll initially start out with a neutral reputation with any given faction, your fame and infamy will eventually push your reputation in different directions. Good reputation. Smiling troublemakers. Some, uh, some good, a little bad. Good-natured rascal. Good, a little bad. Accepted. Some good. Liked. Definitely good. Idolized. Most good. Hmm. All right, I'm not going to read all those. There's there's kind of a lot. But yeah, I'm uh, I'm liked. I've been shunned by the uh, powder gangers. Well, frig the powder gangers. Look at, look at what I think of the powder gangers. Ooh, I like that. Uh, that weapon that feller's got. Powder gang guard armor. I'm gonna take that. And a dude, that guy had some good stuff on him. 
I owe you a huge favor for yeah, this. Yeah, you do, man. Yeah, you, you do. These are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but I know they'll understand once I explain things. Yeah, I just saved your butt, so yeah, you're welcome, man. I'll Thanks for the fun. For Thanks for the money. But I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp. All right, Hello? cool. He said uh, funds, How and I, I almost mixed funds and money and said funny. Thanks for the funny. Much appreciated, buddy. Desperado cowboy hat. I like that. Yeah, let's uh, let's throw that on. Yeah, that's real nice. What kind of armor am I even wearing? Uh, they got some some decent stuff on. I'm getting some ammo at least, at the very least. A little bit of bottle caps never hurt nobody. Uh, is that it? There was one more out here, right? Hiding out in the farm. Picked up some dynamite. Don't know what I'm gonna do with it. So what's uh what's the next objective here? Should I go Should I go back to main story stuff? Track down the source of the Sierra Madre invitation. Find the happy trails caravan master. Travel to the canyon wreckage near Prim and enter the divide. Midnight. Uh oh yeah, okay. Inquire about your delivery assignment with the administrator of Mojave Express and Prim. Find the men who tried to kill you. Okay, so that's main story. Let's let's get back on track here. Let's uh let's head out. Try and figure out what's going on with these men who tried to kill me. So, goodbye, good springs. You've been fun, you've been good. Um have a beautiful time. Maybe I'll stop back sometime. I'm sure I'll be back there at some point. You know, it's um, the decent little town, and you know they like me. I did some good deeds for them, so they like me. Maybe I can do some good deeds for some other folks, and they'll like me also. I suppose I'm probably gonna play this pretty good. I generally like. <clears throat> I tend to just play it as the good guy. You know, like you try and do bad playthroughs, but somehow you always just end up being the good guy. It's like, I make the choices I feel like I would uh, actually make, you know what I mean? And so I end up making the good choices, not the bad choices. Uh, before you venture deeper into the wasteland, you may revise your character. Hmm, edit name. What, what did I name this feller? Oh yeah, it's Jabzol. Jabzol. Uh, hold on one second. Cap has messaged me, and so I should probably send him a message back. Jabzol, let's go. Let's freaking go. Uh, I think we're finished. Let's travel onwards. We can always, like, edit things as we go, you know? I mean, as far as uh, upgrades and stuff, we'll, you know, we'll get to change things here and there. Get to add some different perks and abilities and stuff like that. Is that the? Did I just hear something? Am I am I losing my mind? Am I hearing things? Or is that just the music? I swear I heard something. Prim is up this way? What? Los Angeles and Nipton is that way. What, what do you mean Prim is that way? It's up in that mountain? Why do I always take a sip from my... Oh, boy. Where are you going? Where are you actually going? I'm right here. Do you, do you want... Do you want to fight or... 
I, oh, oh. What the frig? That was a distraction. They were trying to distract me while their buddy came in and frigged me up. God dang, I can't believe they've done this. I can't believe you've done this. Holy frig. Run away. That's what I thought. God dang, freaking... Never knew a... Gecko could be so brutal, man. Freaking geckos. I see you over there. Is that the one I was already taking on? Where did he go? Holy frig, who is this guy? Who is this guy? God dang, I'm glad he's here, but what the fudge? Come in with his motorbike helmet. I'll find you. You'll find me? What do you mean you'll find me? Who wants to find me? Why am I in danger? Are you mad at me? Hey there. He took out the gecko. Dude, that prospector is bad ace. He took out all them freaking geckos, man. I was trying to do some job, you know? I was trying to kill the geckos. But my dude freaking frigged him up. Uh, yeah, dude, that sign is kind of messed up. Because Prim is right here, isn't it? It was telling me to, like, go up in the mountains. Prim is, like, right here. There wasn't no f exit there. There was nothing. White horse net thistle. What is that going to do? For yeah, this is it. God dang idiots. You are going to send me out, out of my way. The wrong way. You have discovered several locations. You can fast travel back to discovered locations using your Pip Boy. Nice, that's good. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? I don't... Prim is off limits. Going to Prim? What's going on in Prim? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. Shouldn't you be protecting the town or something? We'd love to, but they don't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they did, we're in no shape to protect them. Um, thanks for the warning, be but careful. I'm you pretty good with a weapon. Hayes. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. West side. Okay. I guess I'll go this way. Yeah, I don't really want to get shot. That place is no good, I guess. Wait, I'm going to have to go in there anyway. I'm probably going to get shot. I feel like no matter what I do, I'm going to get shot. Who's this? Uh... Got business here? I, th I guess so. I don't know, man. I'm just I'm just doing stuff. Whoa! Why would that be there? I'm crippled. You blew up my freaking leg. Why would you bro blow up my leg? I'm just trying to... I'm just trying to go into town here. That's frigged up, man. That's really... Majorly frigged up. I feel like I'm going to get shot at here real soon. You know, you always enter a town like this in Fallout, and you you get frigged up. Somebody's... There they are. Let's see if I can get the jump on them. That's a bad guy, right? Yep, these are bad guys. Oh, dude, I freaking basically got him before he even had time to react. That guy was a dingus. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. I'm killing it. Literally. No, you've had enough. You have definitely had enough. You butthole -ini. Do I already have a 9mm? Uh, can't remember if I do. I want turpentine. Is turpentine any good for... I guess it's probably good for something, right? Some kind of crafting material. What is 
this place. Oh, my game just crashed. Ooh, uh, I hope we didn't. I hope we didn't fudge it by that happening. I don't know what it was brought Whoa. you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink. It your picked plan. up right here. <laughs> Town's gone to hell. That's honestly kind of crazy. How did it pick up right here? Who are you? Johnson Nash is my name. Husband to Ruby Nash. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. Uh, I'm a courier with the Mojave Express. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I just need info, I think. Uh, I lost a package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. If you have a delivery order, you can show me. What well, can you tell me about this job? Oh, Ooh, this was a good spot to pick up info. Packages. That job had strange written all over, but we couldn't turn down the caps. Uh, what was strange about it? That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Hmm. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. So, that's odd. Somebody canceled and then I come in and I get shot? He canceled? Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain. Jab was still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, let courier six carry the pack. That's what he said. Like the Mojave sort you out or something. Huh. Then he just up and walked out. Yeah, he couldn't be mistaken because, I mean, Jabzola is such a weird name, you know. Do you know who he was, where he went? No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that and turn down the money, too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Not for me to say. Well, some men stole my package, a man in a checkered suit, and some thugs. Did they pass this way? Well, now that you mention it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of those men shot me. I need to know the best way to get them. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. I got find Prim's lawman. Uh, all right, goodbye Don't then. Go getting yourself shot. Yeah, not again. <laughs> Why has he got a weapon pulled? I put my weapon away. Why you got your Why you got your weapon out? Why are you following me with your gun? I don't like that. You're making me nervous. Howdy. Put that away, please. Okay, I guess I guess we're chill. Why do you got your weapon out, too? Why has everybody just got their weapons out? Howdy. God dang, man. Everybody here is too jumpy. Howdy. Why are you all so jumpy? Who are you even aiming at? Howdy. What the fudge is happening? Ooh, Nuka Cola. Move along, please. You move along, butthole Ini. I'm trying to I'm trying to rob this place. There's a bank. How do I get in? Ooh, there's a very easy door that I could pick. I'm hidden. Yo. Okay. Uh, apply torque with a screwdriver, um, rotate the bobby pin, force lock. I've lost karma. Oh, but I'm hidden. Like, I can just come in here and steal. I'm hidden, dude. Like, why would I not? I'm losing more karma. Dang, dude. 
Is that bad? What happens if you lose too much karma? I just wanted to get some money, man. Pre-war money, not useful. Empty nuka cola bottle. Where's the caps? Ooh. Stealing? Dude, stealing really butts you up. Like, why, why am I losing so much karma right now? Lockpick skill of 20. It's an easy one. Why, why do I need such a high skill for easy stuff? Hmm. All right, what is this karma situation? Like, what is that? What does that cause? Is it really bad to have bad karma? Hattie. Hattie. Hattie, partner. All right, so I got to go, like, find the, uh, the sheriff. I got to find the law. This is the law in Lucky Casino. Door to the bison. I guess that is where they said. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I have not had enough. You're going to have enough right now. That's what you get. You've had enough. Ooh, a locked terminal. I can get into it. It's easy. That's a locked door that's hard. I can't get into that. I'm just gonna find the law, man. Egg timer? That is an egg timer. I just picked up all that stuff. I didn't mean to, really. Not over here. I'm not over here. Get shot, you freaking idiot. Come on. There we go. There we go. One more? I don't get one more. He's crowbarring me. Come on. Come on. Back up. Back the frig up. I convict. I, uh. I crippled his torso. God dang it. He's smacking me real good. What happens if I loot in the middle of a fight? Anything? Does anything happen? I think it kind of pauses the game, right? God dang it, I'm getting crippled. Pre be prepared to be... Um, vatsed. You just got vatsed. That's what you get. That's absolutely what you get. I hate to say it, but... You're kind of a dingus. Mm, 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 mm. I have better weapons. I probably need some aid, don't I? I could do a doctor's bag. Restore all body parts. I'm only missing one. So I guess a stimmy pack will do. You know, they didn't really... I guess they didn't really cover that in the Fallout. I should probably hit an F5 for a quick save. Uh, they didn't really cover that in the Fallout show, did they? Like, they brought stim packs in... You know, she used one when she got stabbed. But it didn't, like, have it restoring any any body parts. They did the one weird thing where the guy gave him the stuff to restore his foot, right? That, um... What the butts is he called? A, uh... Oh, God, why am I drawing a blank? The Squire... Yeah, Maximus is Squire, whatever the fudge his name was. They give him that stuff and it heals his foot. But that, I mean, that was about it. They didn't do like the stim pack growing back a leg or something like that. It's a little weird. It doesn't, it doesn't always add up, you know. You get the, the doctor guy and he loses a foot. And he's got to get that robot bad foot put on him. But then uh, you got... Oh, you know what? I should try something. 
Then you got uh, the squire. He gets that special stuff, and he gets his foot grown back. Let's try this out. Oh, dude, that works good. Where did I get all this dynamite? Oh, I'm getting fired. I'm getting massively fired. I don't want to get fired. That's the leader. The leader's got fire. The leader's got fire like crazy. You're getting vatsed. That's for sure. No, I kind of wanted to vats this other feller. Only 39%. I go for a leg. Let's hit that leg. I missed that leg. I completely missed that leg. God dang, stop firing me. I don't like that. No, you're gonna kill me. I don't like that either. What the butts, dude? You need to stop your activities with that fire. I don't like your activities with that fire. Stop. What the butts do you... Where do you get a thing like that? Just because you're a convict leader, th you think you can have big fiery stuff? Butthole. You too. Whatever you got. I don't like it. Freaking idiots. Can I have the fire stuff? Drain flame refuel tank. Flame refuel. Incinerator. Yeah, that's kind of bonkers. Who are you? Oh, it's a deputy. Can I save the deputy? I'll shoot the sheriff, but I won't shoot the deputy. Had enough. Can I actually, like... Oh, I killed... I thought that was me getting dead, but that was him getting dead. Can I save the sheriff? Are you good? You chilling? I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. Uh, you must be Deputy Beagle. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. Um. I'll set you free now. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I you think might I'll give me information my way too. Outside now. The air is a little close in here. Um, sh sure, run away. You don't look like you'd be much help. Then I'll defer to your superior appraisal of character and prowess in contests of arms and see you outside. All right, cool. Get the frig out of here. I think we're, I mean, like, I'm pretty much done anyway. Right? I've taken everybody out in here. Anybody else want some of this? I think we're good. I don't want the deputy to get killed. I think that's bad. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Can I have some of that? I can't have some of that. Well, that's butts. All right, I guess we just head out of here. I, I've done... That's that's all I needed to do. So why would I hang around? We saved a feller. And we got some good stuff, too. I got a... I got like a flamethrower. Now. Well... That was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course. But it was quite thrilling. He's Problem claiming is, he broke no himself out now? What an idiot. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Uh, can you tell me about the man in the checkered suit who came ah, through here? yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was uh, uh, performing recon gathering information on some of the powder gangers when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit they were talking about some delivery they took from a courier i assume that was you that's me they said they'd be heading through nipton to novak to meet a contact there okay cool uh completed fine prim's lawman uh head to novak okay yeah let's uh let's move right along then I think there's somebody out there. I'm going to switch to my other weapon so I can hit him from afar. Let's see. Mercenary grenade rifle. Whoa. 
Switchblade, Caravan, Shotgun, Throwing Spears, Weathered 10mm, Varmint Rifle. That's what I be using. Taking new vermins out. F5. I'm seeing red, but then it's disappearing. Are they, they wandering around out there? Oh well, they got their lawman back, so they don't need me, do they? So long as they got their lawman back. I'm gonna have to cross some desert here. This this doesn't look very good. I'm a little bit worried about this. I'm afraid there's gonna be rattlesnakes and scorpions and geckos and death claws. I'm I'm not I'm not a fan of any of those things. Is that a sandstorm or is that just it just looks like regular sand blowing through? Doesn't look like anything too crazy. Nothing too bonkers. I have a present for you from the Powder Gangers. I hope you like dynamite. What? Dude was like a mile away. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> All right. He didn't even give me a present. What a freaking jerk. They were enemies. They showed up and they're like, we got a present for you. And then they just, nothing. Whatever. You know, I also, I did steal from Prim. I might have saved their, uh, their sheriff. But, no, he's not even a sheriff. He's a deputy. I saved the sheriff, but I didn't save the deputy. Except for... Are they friendly? They ought to be friendly, right? I Like, they had them in town. They were friendly. They're not mad, right? You're not mad, are you? You're good? Why are, you, why are they red? Whatever that is, that's weird. I need to get more saves before majorly bad things happen. This looks like town, right? This looks like some kind of town. Got any holes in your fence that I can just kind of sneak on in? Ooh, just about. Just about made it in. That's Your security's not the best. I won't lie to you. Can't really do any jumping maneuvers, it seems. There's got to be a way to jumping maneuver in here. Oh, yeah, dude. I can jumping maneuver in. Walk right in. I've discovered Nipton. This seems weird and cultish. Whatever's happening here. Recruit. Degenerates like you belong on a... Don't worry. I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. What? It's useful that you happen by. I want you to witness the fate of the town of Nipton, to memorize every detail. And then, when you move on, I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson that Kaisar's Legion taught here. Kaisar? Especially any NCR troops you run across. Isn't it supposed to be Caesar? Uh, what lesson did you teach her? Where to begin? That they are weak and we are strong? This much was known already. But the depths of their moral sickness, their dissolution, huh. Nipton serves as the perfect object lesson. This is weird. I've, uh, I've heard enough. I think your eyes will see more than I could ever tell you. Take your time. Enjoy the sights. Dude, this is weird. Oh, look at what they've done. Near death, remove them from the cross would kill them. Okay. Yo. What the fudge? These were powder gangers. Holy crap, they've done some bonkers stuff. I think, um... Are they out of, are they out of your shot? I'm gonna put them out of their misery. 
Oh, that didn't even put him out of his... That put him out of his misery. <laughs> I'm just going to put him out of their misery. Also, oh, they don't have anything on them. Oh, well, at least it... At least it, uh, it kind of saves them from suffering on the cross there, you know? It's kind of crazy that they these guys are crucifying people out here. That's insane. Vodka. I knew I'd get something. So now how do I how do I continue on my quest here? Alex Jenkins, is this your first time playing? Yes it is. And uh welcome to the stream by the way. How you doing today? Oh, there's another. Put them out of their misery. So now I'm in Nipton, but what do I, what do I gain from this? It's like everybody's been, they were powder gangers anyway, but they all been murderized it seems. Oh, and I crashed. <laughs> See it, it picks up right where I left off, but still. Was that a gunshot? Find the men who tried to kill you. Okay, I'd like to do that, but uh, where I was supposed to stop here, and like everybody's all dead and stuff. So that's not very good. Oh, toilet. Sick. I've been sipping on the toilet water quite a bit. That one gives me rads. I didn't get rads from any of the other toilet water. But that's pretty tasty. What do we got here? Tasty? Yep, that's tasty. But it's giving me rads. Hmm. Oh, it's Legion Mongrels. Oh, frig. They left some... Dude, what the fudge? They left a bunch of dogs in here? I'm getting out of here. I'm just getting out of here. That's frigged up, man. They're just going to leave a bunch of dogs in there to freaking attack me? Is anybody left alive? Why did they do this? Why would they do a thing like this? God dang, dude. This Kaiser is bonkers. He calls himself Kaiser? He spells it Caesar, but he calls himself Kaiser, too. What a weirdo. Just ruin that whole town. You know, I'd like to go... I'd like to go explore these actual areas, like, in real life. Just to see uh, what they're like. Be kind of cool. You know, people that are from there are probably just like, yeah, look at I, I know this place. I, I've been here. They left a guy that won the lottery they had. Oh, okay. So I can find a person. Oh, I just got blown up a little bit. So I can actually find a guy in that town. Yo, Ross in the chat. What's up, Ross? Welcome, buddy. How's it going today? All right, I'm going to go back to town and see if we can talk to that. Do you know, like, whereabouts he'd be? Is he in, like, one of the houses or something? Ross dropping a story about how Bean was, uh, he was challenging Boss Ross to a floof dog fight, but the Dovahkiin showed up because he just had some beers that he wanted to drink. So Boss Ross hopped in the van. He took Floof Dog. Him and Boss Ross went and ate some beans. They ran over the Dovahkiin, killed him. He died. WT Fudge, why would they do that? Because Boss Ross had a beef with uh, the Dovahkiin. So Boss Ross, he <laughs> he became the Dovahkiin, actually, because that's how it works. You kill him, you become them. And then he ended up with all the beans, but because he ate so many beans, he died. And that's um, that's pretty much how it went, Ross. So, so we can f head to Novak and find people, or we can uh, head to Novak through Nipton. Okay, but I, I'd like to find if there's somebody else still alive here. Alex Jenkins is saying they left the guy that had won the lottery. So, are they in um, that building? Am I going to have to go through the wolves? 
If that's the case, I may just move on. I could check out some of these houses. Anybody home? Oh, they got some corn. Or maize. Yucca, mesquite pod. Ross says, you live tomorrow? Uh, I was thinking about trying to do a, a night a night stream. I have, um, if you saw on my main channel, I've got the Starlink. Live tomorrow in the van. Yeah, we'll see. I, I may I may do that. Either tonight or tomorrow. We'll we'll see how it works out. But yeah, I do have the uh, I do have the Starlink. Starlink is set, so I can I can stream from the van now. It's just a matter of uh, you know being able to to do it. Oh boy. Oh boy. You're gonna get shoosted. I'm not trying to shoost you in the claw. I'm trying to shoost you in the body. Fudge, 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 fudge. Come on, in the body. That's butts. Come on. God dang, I'm getting beat up by a scorpion. Uh, Alex says, I think you find them going to the next town. I thought uh, you should have ran into them already. Oh, okay. So they're they're not hanging around. They're they're on the move. Okay, so we'll... Whoa, I'm tripping. Am I going to die? That doesn't seem good for my health. Do I have any, like, anti-venom? Um, you know, a stim pack ought to fix that, right? Maybe a little bit of wine also. Good luck. You should play Minecraft Void Block in the van. I can't really do that because my PC is in the house. The Minecraft Void Block is... Oh, crap, dude. Um... Yeah, Minecraft Void Block is on the PC in the house. I'm going to be streaming from my Switch in the van with um, my laptop. So that's not really a possibility. God dang it, dude. I'm going to die, aren't I? I think the venom is, like, killing me. I don't know if the stim packs are helping. Wait, maybe it stopped? Does the sipping from my rusty um, vault tech canteen, does that help me any? Uh-oh. Oh, frig, 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 frig. I'm doing a super stim. Come on. Who is this? Viper Gunslinger. I'm going to shoot them in the head. I had no choice. I'm shoosting you in the foot, in the body, in the face, whatever. Frig off. Stop moving around. God dang it, one of them down. I don't know if there's more. There's probably more. Where are they at? Where are they at? Where are they at? Super stim pack wore off. What does a super stim pack even do for me? Where are they at? Up on the freaking hill. God dang, how are you getting up on the hill like that? I can't hit him from this far away. Did I actually get up there? No, you've had enough. You dingleberry. You dingleheimer. You dingleheimer schmidt. You freaking turd monger. You absolute buttholeini. I'm out of ammo. God dang it. So many insults. And I run out of ammo. 
Yeah, get frigged up. That's a level up. So let's up, um, guns. Yeah, let's up guns. Let's up lockpick. Uh, medicine, maybe. Unarmed. No, I'm not doing that. Survival, we could up that a little bit. Speech, always good. Sneak, maybe. Science, repair. And that's good. That'll be really good. Onward we go. That was a good maneuver. I wasn't. I didn't end up dead, so that's good. That's always a good sign. Yeah. So Ross, I think I'm actually. I think I'm gonna just stream uh, Stardew Valley from my uh, Switch in the van for now. I have some other Switch games I can play also. Um, I could also. I could actually get Minecraft on the Switch and try that out. I don't know, maybe I could try playing a game from my laptop. My laptop, like, it runs good when I'm playing just a game on it. Oh, my wine wore off. Frig, man. Like, my laptop runs great when I'm just playing the game, but when I'm trying to, like, stream and play or when I'm trying to, like, record and play, it's a little bit much for it. So that's why I was going to use the Switch, um, you know, capture carded to the laptop, so that way it's, like, taking the stress off of my laptop. Know what I mean? I'm excited for the Switch 2. I can't wait for that. There's probably going to be some pretty good stuff coming on the Switch 2. Actually, I have Skyrim too. I wish they'd put Fallout 4 on um, Fallout 4 on the Switch. Speech, Science, and Barter are good ones. Also, there's a lot of dialogue choices where they're required, says Alex. Yeah, I saw that already um, when I was trying to help Ringo in uh, Good Springs. I was trying to help Ringo and um, to get people to follow you, you have to like have the right speech for like explosives, uh, barter, um, to like get convince people. So that is pretty. It's pretty interesting. Yeah, I definitely like barter and speech because speech helps like just convincing people in general, I think. So it's always a good one to have. Guns I kind of like too because I'm, I'm using guns. I'm not really going at people swinging or anything like that. A little nervous walking out here in the in the desert like this. I do see... Something. A Night Stalker? What the frig is a Night Stalker? What the... What is that? It has eggs? Yo, that looked like a freaking dog or something. It has eggs? What? What in the name of butts, man? So crashing, that's bad. And also the not being able to... Oh, another one. Also the not being able to sprint kind of bothers me a bit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can you chill just a little bit? I only have five ammos left and I just died. Who is over there shoosting? Also, a lot of good side quests, so don't complete the main story too quick because you won't be able to play after, I think, unless you have the DLC. Yeah, I have all the DLC also. Um, so there's a, there's going to be a lot to do. But like you said, I should definitely... I should definitely... God dang it. I was trying to eat up and get my health up, but it didn't work. I should definitely do some side questing, that's for sure. Let me maybe... Let's get some... Yeah, let's get some health up here. Oh, it, it ups you by two. Oh, okay, I see. It's weird how this works. It's not like the regular... Um... 
Yeah, it's not like the, the, the fallout I'm used to. It's a little different. What the frig is this thing, man? Why? Oh my god, this is so weird. <laughs> this is so bizarre. What is happening right now? Okay, caution. I'm gonna try and avoid instead. Because that thing is really butting me up. What kind of battle is happening here? Oh, he's there. He's on me. I can't run. <laughs> I just got shot. I'm trying to run from that thing and I end up getting shot by another freaking dude. Also, a lot of... Oh, okay. I already read that one. A lot of good side quests. Yeah, let's run for it. I'm sure this thing's pretty fast, but if I do run jumping, maybe I'll escape. And I maybe I'll try to not get shot by lasers. I'm feeling lasers coming at me. Holy frig, jumping helps. Yep. Yeah, it seems like it is helping. Holy frig, holy frig. I'm escaping. I think I'm actually escaping. I was a little bit stuck in a loop there. So how long is uh, the main main story? Is it pretty long? I can always, like, maybe next episode. I kind of just want to get here. Maybe next episode I can fast travel back to some of the places I've already been. And do a little bit more side questing. I think I've escaped. But there's more baddies ahead. Oh, they, we'll let them do their own thing. Are they going to come after me? For, like, wanting to get somewhere faster, jumping helps. Yeah, it seems like it It does a little bit uh, make you move faster. I've heard there's some mods that, like, majorly improve this game, though. Like, um, a sprint mod, and I think there's some mods that kind of fix the whole crashing issue. Because I've, I've had a, quite a few crashes already. Ranger Station Charlie. Oh, I see a big dinosaur. What the heck is that? It seems like jumping helps you escape, too. Because, like, it feels like you're not as fast as, as the creatures and, and the uh, enemies. It's like, it feels like if you jump, it, it actually makes you get away from them easier. Alex says, no, it's short. Okay. So, yeah, uh, I'll get here, and then I think in the next... Uh, Next episode, we'll do some side questing. That sounds like a pretty good plan. We'll just get, like, the travel locations, you know? We have arrived at Novak. So, yeah, I think uh, at that point, I'll go ahead and call it a day for today's episode of Fallout New Vegas. So hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit that like button down below. That helps me out a bunch. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notifications. So that way you're not going to miss out on future streams or videos. Join the Discord. You can come by and chat. And if you want to help uh, support the channel, it's only 99 cents here on YouTube to become a member. But that gets you a bunch of cool perks. You get access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server. Join when you want or with me on Fridays. We're going to be streaming that again for Season 3 once 1.21 of Minecraft comes out. Also, merch. Uh, the shirt I'm wearing, as well as the uh, the hat, you can pick that up. Link is in the description and also on the channel page. Uh, follow on Twitch if you want to watch over there. I'm live streaming on YouTube and Twitch, and uh, possibly some either Friday night or Saturday night live streams from the van coming soon. Those are gonna be exciting. So, uh, anyways, guys, thanks again for watching, and hopefully, I will see you in the next one. Peace.